Bridget? She stole my weed money. She's old. I'm sure she doesn't even remember playing cards with us. I need that money, Jerry. Yeah, join the club. I heard you wanted to move back in. No, I... I don't want to. I just need a place to stay until I can get back on my feet. Hey! Pay up if you're gonna indulge. Come on, bridge. Family discount. Hey. I'm a prisoner here, Jerry. I'd do anything to switch places with you. Who are you talking to? No, none of your goddamn business. It's a dude. Get out of here. <laughs> Called it. <laughs> Hello. Vince likes Vag 78. I hope he's a gynecologist. We're together, sort of. Mom and Dad ever met this Vince? No, not exactly. We met online. Wait, you've never met this guy? No. Yes. Okay, not yet. It's probably a 300-pound midget with club feet. No, I have pictures. They're probably not even him. Come on, Bridge. What do you expect? I'm stuck here all the time. I am 87% sure that this Vince guy is a serial killer. All right. I'm sorry, okay? Are you going to meet him? We've talked about it. He lives in Connecticut, near the casino. I think he has a gambling problem. Holy shit. You're not perfect either, fatty. No, 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 I'm brilliant. What are you talking about? We should take Nana to the casino. Why? Think about how good she is at cards. If we, if we were playing strip poker right now, we would be limbless. Think about all the money we'd make. How would we get her all the way out there? Uh, tell her we'll take her someplace old people enjoy. Uh, uh, an Asian buffet. Yeah. Um, coupon dispensary? And then we can split the winning, 60-40. <sighs> I came up with the idea. No way. Oh, come on. You could put that money towards an apartment and, and live your life. Go to rehab, or buy more drugs. I'm in. Yes. We can take my car? Perfect. On one condition. Anything. I want to surprise Vince on the way. We'll see. No deal, no car. Fine. <laughs> Then straight to the casino. A nice weekend activity with Nana. <laughs>